Hi, my name is Adrian, and today I read One Crazy Summer and the sequels PSB 11 and Gone Crazy in Alabama by Rita Williams Garcia. The first book is about uh, three sisters, Delphine, Vanetta, and Fern, uh, and they are they live in Brooklyn, and they're raised by their grandmother and their father and they're going to visit their mother in California. Their mother, Cecile, is a poet, and she doesn't really seem interested in her kids. And she likes to be in her kitchen and work on her poems, not really pay attention to them. She writes poems for a group called the Black Panthers, and they're a group of black freedom fighters. Delphine and her sisters haven't really paid attention to the blacks being mistreated in the 1960s because their grandmother discourages them speaking out because she doesn't want them to get mistreated or hurt. In this book they learn about bravery and kindness and strength and about equal rights for all. Uh, in the second book, PSP 11, Delphine is worrying about a lot of things, and she thinks that she has to fix every problem. She keeps in touch with her mother by writing letters after she arrives back home, and her mother keeps reminding her to be 11 while she still can. P.S.B. 11. In the third book, they go visit their grandmother. Because uh, she moves back to her farm, um, they go to visit her grandmother and her mother, Ma Charles, and in this one, Delphine and Vanetta are having trouble, and they're not getting along with each other, and they're constantly fighting and stuff, and, and then a hurricane blows up, and Vanetta goes missing, and then Delphine uh, regrets being mean to her. Will they, and will they find Vanetta in this one? If you, if you want to find out, I think you should read the series One Crazy Summer, PSP 11, and Gone Crazy in Alabama by Rito Williams Garcia. I really like this series, and I think you should read it. See you next time. Bye.